Hi, I'm JB. I'm the developer lead for the Visual Studio Tools for Unity. Since Microsoft made the Visual Studio Tools for Unity a free Visual Studio extension two years ago, we've seen an incredibly large number of developers using our extension to bridge Visual Studio, a fantastic c -sharp integrated development environment, and Unity, a tool that is now completely ubiquitous. There are millions of Unity game developers producing games for all platforms that are played on billions of devices. We've talked to Unity developers online and at conferences, we gathered feedback and decided to really work on what mattered to Unity developers. Most of the feedback we got resolved around what I think are the fundamentals of an IDE. Because Unity is the central application they work with, most Unity developers use Visual Studio for what it's best known for, an excellent coding editing experience coupled with a fantastic debugger. And that's exactly what we've been focusing on. The first thing we've worked on is the Visual Studio setup. Visual Studio 2017 comes with this new installer, which is much faster and provides you with a much finer granularity over what you want to install. Unity developers have their own workload they can select, and in just a few clicks, install just what is necessary to develop Unity games. As a result, Visual Studio 2017 for Unity game developers installs faster and starts faster. You just install and use what you need. The second thing we've worked on is the code editing. Sometimes Unity has its own way of doing things that c -sharp developers are not always familiar with. Let's take Unity messages, for instance. Those methods that are invoked from the game engine on your scripts, we've made the editor colorize them so developers can identify them easily. We've also plugged directly into the Visual Studio 2017 IntelliSense engine to recognize them and provide code completion for them. In just a few keystrokes, you can declare your Unity messages and they immediately stand out from other methods. The third things we've focused on is the debugging experience. We've made it faster, more reliable, and we've drastically improved the expression evaluation, which is essential, for instance, if you're doing vector or matrix operations, or you'll stop at a breakpoint. Let's have a look at the Visual Studio Tools for Unity 3 in Visual Studio 2017. This is Unity 5.4 with the Unity game sample that comes with Unity open on the aircraft scene. It's a very simple game where you can pilot your plane through rings. And as you can see, when the plane takes off, the landing gear rises. And when you land, the landing gear uh, are lowered. So let's open the script in Visual Studio that controls the landing gear. This is Visual Studio 2017, open on the script. As you can see directly, both the start and update methods are colorized. Those are Unity messages. Those are methods that are called from the Unity game engine directly. And we made them stand out by colorizing them like keywords. So you immediately know which methods are invoked by the game engine. If you need to create, uh, if you need to write them, it's very simple. Just start an IntelliSense session, declare a method, and we directly inject into the IntelliSense engine all the Unity messages that you can use in your scripts, such as on collision enter here. For Visual Studio 2017 and the Visual Studio Tools for Unity 3, we really improved the debugging experience. We made it much faster. For instance, let's go back to the game, start it, and attach the debugger. I put a breakpoint when the landing gear will raise. We immediately break into Visual Studio. You can step. Everything is very fast. The auto window will show you everything that is related to your current method. We added support for a lot of expressions, 
C sharp expression into the immediate window. You can even declare variables now. Let's declare a simple hexadecimal integer. And in the watch window, we, you can access it. We added support for hexadecimal display of integers. To get started writing Unity games with Visual Studio 2017, just go to visualstudio.com, download Visual Studio 2017 Community Edition, install the Unity workload, and you'll be good to go.